Hello, everyone. I am your host, Leisha Bush Anderson, Global Senior Manager for Talent Acquisition Marketing at, here at T-Tech. And welcome to Volume 3, Episode 13 for the talent show sponsored or powered by T-Tech. Uh, join us every other Thursday at 12 noon Eastern to focus on T-Tech's most valuable asset, which is our people. Um, Want to kick this off first by finding out where are you located? Drop it in the chat. Um, we'd love to see where you guys are globally. And um, it's a lot of fun for us to be able to chime in as well. So I am in Houston, Texas. For those that have never been to Houston, Texas, um, one of the best things that, that we like to do um, is definitely go to Turkey Leg Hut. So for those that know about Turkey Leg Hut, it's the best. But also you can go check out the NASA Space Center. Um, that's a lot of fun uh, things to do as well. Of course, we have great sunny days. It's really hot right now, but um, a lot of fun. So love to see where you guys are located uh, today. Uh, let's see what we got. Uh, Oklahoma. Love Oklahoma. That's a lot of fun. Hi, everyone. Drop where you're located. Mexico City, Kansas City, Missouri. Great. Where else are we? Okay, we have India, Inglewood, where our corporate office is. Whoop, whoop. Uh, let's see, we also have, okay, we have a lot. Assam, India, South Bend, Indiana. All right, shout out in Indiana. It'd be fun if you guys could put what there what there is to do in your area too, because I, I love to travel. Vancouver, Zimbabwe, love it. ATL, Lebanon. We got a lot of you guys on this uh, live today. San Jose, Costa Rica, Phoenix, Northern Ireland. Hello, hello from the UK. Okay, we have a lot of you guys chiming in. Thank you so much for joining us today for um, our, our talent show. Again, we, we do this every other Thursday at 12 noon Eastern. Um, and so we are excited about today and our conversation. Um, today, our special guest is Vicki Steer, who is our Global Executive Director of Talent Acquisition Marketing. So we're excited to have her join in this conversation today so we can actually talk about all things social media um, for, for a lot of you, of course. Um, we want you to stay with us the entire live because we will talk about our featured jobs of the week and um, other ways for you to join us um, as an organization. So, okay. There we go. Hi, Vicki. Hi, Alicia. How are you? I am amazing. Now, where are you located? I'm also, I'm in Aurora, Colorado, which is like 15 minutes from our corporate headquarters here in Inglewood. Um here in Colorado today, um, they're going to be doing the um, Stanley Cup. The Abs, our local hockey team, just won the Stanley Cup. And Whoa. The, um, and the parade is going to be downtown today. So that's really exciting here in Colorado. Yeah. I'm so jealous. <laughs> I wish I could be there. That sounds like so much fun. <laughs> so much fun. That's awesome. Well, we're super excited to speak with you today, Vicki. Um, and I'm sure audience, if you guys have questions um, as we have this discussion, please feel free to chime in. Um, this is a dialogue for all of us to be able to learn today. So um, what I, I, Vicki, if you could maybe one, jump in and talk a little bit more about kind of your role and then also share a bit about how you actually got involved uh, with T-Tech social media. Sure, sure. So I am passionate about uh, the employment experience. So my job officially is um, global talent acquisition marketing. And uh, best way to say that is that we're about the external employment brand. How do we attract the talent to T-TAC? Because truly T-TAC is all about our talent. Um, we're a service company at the end of the day. Um, whether we're working with our contact centers, whether we're doing consulting, whether we're um, supporting the technology behind the scenes that powers the customer experience, it's all driven by our talent. And we have some amazing talent here. Um, now, 
what, um, how I got involved in social media, it's uh, well beyond, uh, well prior to um, to TTAC. And that's what I was kind of hired to do initially, well, way back a decade ago. Um, but, you know, if you remember back, uh, well, may, many may not, social media is just such a part of our lives today um, that it naturally becomes a part of employment brand. In 2006, if you think way back to 2006, that feels like eons ago. ago. <laughs> yeah, eons ago. Time Life actually named the person of the year as you because social media was starting to take a hold. Social media isn't all of the news. It's not Facebook. It's not LinkedIn. It's not, it's not Snapchat or TikTok. What social media is, is the power of all of us having a voice on the internet and having a voice. If you think back, way back, a website used to be one-sided, you know, it used to be, but now when you go to a T, your local TV channel, sure, that's an that's a media, but if, uh, but every story you have the ability to comment on, that's what social media is. It gives us all a voice. Yeah. And, um, you know, and how it's involved in employment brand is really about listening. It's about us being able to listen to the voice of the customer, which in this case is our people. Yeah, absolutely. And and it's funny because when we talk about just the, the that evolve experience with social media, I mean, from the AOL chats back in the 90s, um, I'm dating myself here, but I, I'm still young. Um, but the AOL chats in the 90s to MySpace to to uh, Facebook, everybody, I think, remembered that friend Tom on MySpace. So, you know, things have definitely changed. But in, more importantly, kind of to your point, it, how it impacts employment branding is significant um, compared to just, you know, 10 to 12 years ago. Yeah, sure. And, um, you know, so you think about it. Um, when I first started in um, with TTAC, um, I, I, you know, I was built because we did have an employment brand. We did have social media presence, but it was a little more, um, if you will, grassroots, which is the beauty of social media. It is grassroots. Um, and I was not, you know, and then there was this term called that, that the executives brought out called let's control the message. And I said, oh, no, 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 no. You don't control the message in social media. You, inf you can influence it. You can share it. You can amplify the, um, the things, but you can't control it. What we're going to do is, is just share and be real. Um, and, you know, so from anything from um, we, we don't. Um, you know, some people think that we create, um, there might there might be an impression that some companies create fake profiles to control that message. And that is one thing that we have absolutely not done. We will, um, we're all about making sure that it's real, that it's us talking. Um, and you, Leisha, you know, have, I'm so excited to have you on the team too um, in supporting our global social media team. Um, we're a small team. You know, if you think about it with 60,000 employees um, and we want to put out a very transparent, real message about who we are. I always say, um, and you can tell I'm a little passionate about the, about the <laughs> subject. Um, I always say that, um, I always say that, you know, social media has the opportunity of giving a small company a brand and a large company like ours a personality. Yes. We, you know, we want to show you who we are behind yeah. the scenes. Draw back. Yeah, and, and we're and we're totally doing that. I mean, our team is small but mighty and shout out to our our global social media team. <laughs> but yes. um, you know, they're 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 getting the work done and and showing that personality and and having some really great um think outside the box uh ideas for us to get in front of um our, you know, potentially our candidates um and partners. So um, so my question to you is, you know, do we just advertise jobs in social media? Actually, no, that's a very small portion of what we do. 
what we really want to do is, as I mentioned, we want to, um, we certainly utilize, uh, you know, social media as an advertising uh, medium to, to share our opportunities with the public. But um, we have kind of a less than one third, you know, and it's closer to about 25% of our um, official, um, of our official kind of commentary is about the jobs themselves. What we like to do is talk about who, like I said, our personality. And we want even more. Um, we want that content from the local sites. Tell us what you're doing uh, from the local teams. You know, what are you proud of? Where are we? And, um, and literally anyone in our company can help contribute. Um, certainly we have a funnel that we put it through and make sure that it's, uh, it's brand compliant and that we're, you know, utilizing the right, um, the right avenues. We certainly, um, you know, one of the things we don't do as an organization is use copyrighted materials from other organizations, um, such as music and those kinds of things, but we will use royalty free music. We'll use things that will whatever we can do to spice it up and share um, and we love the stories. We love stories within our own organization of people that have grown up within the organization, um, have um, have built a career. I myself, I'm a boomerang. Um, I stayed. I came to the company, um, you know, and left after about three years. And I, you know, and I found myself that the grass isn't always greener on the other side of the fence. And I am here. I'm now a T Tech lifer. I've decided I've come back, and, and there's and you're stuck with me, T Tech. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the great news for us, actually. <laughs> um, and you know, it's it's funny when you when we we talk about advertising jobs and and even just the impact of social media. A lot of times, um, companies feel that uh, social media is, should be limited when it comes to a a company brand, right? Is, hey, you guys fit in this small box and and that's it. But, you know, here at T-Tech, it's great because we're able to not just advertise jobs. We're telling that T-Tech story where it's, we're sharing the, the T-Tech experience for our employees and um, and our leaders within the organization and, and be able to dig in deeper in those conversations. So that way, for those that maybe have never heard of us or for those that are interested in joining the T-Tech family, they can learn more about us uh, kind of through through our content. So that's great. Um, so you know, we're all- oh. You know, Lisa, I'd like to kind of pull out a couple of the comments. The comments yeah. are, the reason this is, this is so important is that it is transparent. Um, and I, I wanna call out, um, you know, yes, we have had um, a, some really great comments, people that love working here. And, um, and Lavesh, I, I, I pull it out and I say, okay, you, you say no value of employees. I personally disagree. However, I also um, want you to know that you have a voice at T-Tech. And if there is something that you feel um, isn't being done or isn't being shared, um, you know, and, and, you know, you've got your supervisor, that's what, that's your first line of, of discussion. But I also want you to know that we have lines, like we hear you lines. If there's a, if there's a concern, um, if there's an ethics concern, if there's a um, area, um, I personally am an open networker on LinkedIn, message me on LinkedIn. I want to hear from you and I want to be able to, um, you know, our company does want to solve those problems. Sometimes people can feel like they don't have a voice. I want everyone to hear and know that we hear you. And we, and we, and that's one of the beauty of, you can say that on social media. You can say, because not every company is for every individual. And, um, and I will share, T-Tech is a fast moving company. It's the fastest, slowest company you've ever met. <laughs> <laughs> so true. Um, and so, you know, so there's so many things that are great here. And it's not just like any other company. It's not for everyone. So we want to hear what makes it better for you. If it's not for you, that's okay. Mm -hmm. We want you to grow your career. And and um, let me just also share that there's, I mean, I'm, I'm going into my passion here, but T-Tech is a lot of opportunities while you're here 
that if you're not taking advantage of it, that's on you. Because mm-hmm. there's so many, um, you know, T-Tech, our T-Tech talent has so many free, um, you know, ex- education opportunities, et cetera. And while you're here, take advantage of those. And if it doesn't fit you at this time, that's okay too. Yep. So, I'm and sorry. Maybe, and, maybe, and, that's, and that's a good point because, and I'll, and I'll just say this is a good segue of, you know, if, if it's not a good fit now, it could be a fit, good fit later. <laughs> As yes. we, we recently shared on our LinkedIn post this week that thousands of uh, alumni or what we call T-Tech boomerangs come back each year. Yeah. Um, and there's a reason why. And so, again, it may not be a good fit now or ever, but sometimes it may be, come on, come on back. We'll definitely be happy to have that conversation with you. Um, so we're all excited that the company is approaching a big milestone in social media. Yes. Vicki, what is that milestone? We are so close. We are within inches of hitting 1 million cumulative followers across our social media channels. And so, you know, we're asking everyone on here to make sure you're following all of our channels. Um, If you're a current employee, uh, go to Mosaic um, and go to our, you know, you can go to my company and there's T-Tech and Social has every single one of our channels. You can follow it. You can follow it. You can comment. You can engage, share with your with your followers. Um, And two, if any of you um, that aren't with T-Tech right now, great places to find out about our current opportunities, how to connect with other employees at T-Tech to ask what it's really about, what's it really like. So um, Lisha, I know uh, I'm going to pass it back to you and, and share all of the channels that we're on. Yes. So we are on, of course, you guys are watching us on LinkedIn here, but we also are on Facebook. You can look at Facebook and type in T-Tech. We'll pull up there. We have T-Tech USA, T-Tech in different regions, the Philippines. We have T-Tech Mexico. We have T-Tech India, all on Facebook. So take a look at our Facebook and type in T-Tech in all of our pages from Canada to Brazil. We have a page there for you. Also, we are on Instagram at T-Tech Life. Check us out there. We'll have content, again, across the globe um, that you can also engage with. We also are on YouTube at T-Tech Life on YouTube. And then we also have Twitter at T-Tech Life. So go on our social media channel, stalk us. We love stalkers and (laughs) engage with us as much as you can. Um, we would love to see you there and, and, and engage in a conversation with you as well. Um, okay, so I think I think that wraps up some of our questions for you, Vicki. Um, is there any kind of last minute thoughts you have? I say, you know, look, I, I say, please, we wanna engage. Um, and if you are a current employee and have local content, we'd love to share it. So, you know, you can email us at social media team. You can DS uh, at ttech.com. You can uh, DM us um, on any of our social channels. We would love to see it. Um, And by all means, uh, continue to watch for our social media. I see Bogota coming. T-Tech Columbia will be coming up soon. So watch for us there. And uh, and thank you so much for your time. And, um, And please do follow us on all of our channels. Thank you, Vicky. And everyone, we are still partying now. We're just going to wrap up with a few things because we want to make sure that you um, have what you need from us. So if you are interested in joining our team, you can view all of our opportunities at ttechjobs.com. Um, we're going to queue up the website so that way you can see exactly where you need to go to search um, for some opportunities. So for those that are wondering, wait, how do I do it? Or I saw someone comment, hey, I want to come back to T-Tech. Great. We want to have you here too. So go to our website, ttechjobs.com. Once you go on, there we go. Once you're on our website, um, you'll be able to do a search, um, particularly uh, no matter what region you may be or what part of the globe you are in or located. You can look for work for home jobs specifically, or you can also look at um, jobs that are have on site because remote maybe is not necessarily for everyone, right? Um, so as you can see here on my screen, you'll go in and you can type in your search, the keyword for a role, or you could just type in the location. 
um, as we have here, or you can just do type in our, or actually go to our work from home tab to find remote opportunities. Um, we do have two feature jobs today that we want to share with you in case you or someone you know may be interested. Um, our first feature job is staff accountant. Um, so we're gonna share that here on my screen as well. So you could take a look at it. Again, um, if you're interested in any other opportunities, uh, feel free to go on our website, but we're featuring two today. Uh, for this week, staff accountant, it is a remote opportunity. So feel free to go on to our website and search for a staff accountant. If you may not be interested, you may know someone else. So please share the job um, with people in your network, particularly here on LinkedIn. And our second feature job of the week um, is our online marketing sales representative opportunity. Um, also, you can go on to our website and type in online marketing sales representative and be able to uh, apply to that or share that job as well. So um, again, feel free to drop in the comments. Um, if you have any additional questions, we would love to answer that for you. Oh, there we go. Um, online marketing sales representative. So uh, again, take a look and see if that's something that you or someone you know may be interested in. So uh, I think we had a great day today is social media day. So Again, shout out to all the social media teams that are watching us, whether you're a T-Tech employee or you're a non-T-Tech employee. Uh, we want to celebrate that with you today. And then also, of course, remember that we have our shows every other week um, on every other Thursday, excuse me, at 12 noon, which means our next show will be on July 14th at 12 noon Eastern. Um, see you at the next talent show with our host, Jen. Uh, who will be back to talk to you and have a special guest on her on that episode. So thank you guys for watching us and joining us for another talent show. We hope you found it impactful and fun. Have a great weekend and a great long weekend because it's a holiday weekend for those that are in the U.S. Thank you so much, guys. Have a great day. Mm -hmm.